while we learn about the opposition on the pitch, Wiser learns how to heat my home. Joshy, uh, you've had almost four weeks since action and that, but uh, Rob said this morning there's a real buzz about the place. You want to get back and play some rugby and huge game, local derby on Friday night. Yeah, no, definitely. I think, you know, we've got a point to prove. It's probably not the game like you'd have in the past seasons where it's top of the second, you know. We've always got points to prove and obviously not having the performances we've had so far this year, we're, we're really looking to, to build on that and really finish the season strong. Two five-point wins, that's what Rob said, is yeah. the minimum there. I guess, you know, any chance of playoffs, you've got to do that, haven't you? Yeah, well, to be honest, we're just going to go and play rugby. We're going to play rugby, play, play, work hard and play to our best ourselves, play to our strengths, you know. Those five points will come if we enjoy ourselves and we work hard. Um, we've got a great bunch of boys out there, probably top top team we're going to play against as well, so it's going to be a good game. How weird has the last month been? Because it's been a bit stop-start, you've been out, had a rest, you've been training, you've yeah. been doing all sorts. No, no, it's been difficult. I think it's been it's been good for the, some of the players, because a lot of the players have had 80 minutes back-to-back -back most weeks. So it's a good good, good couple of weeks to like recap what we're about and what we're going to do from now on. You know, we're rebuilding, building that new extra Chiefs that everyone says they're going to be, but you know, We've come together as a squad. We've worked really hard over the past couple of weeks, and you know, looking to put a, a real good performance out on Friday night and away at Bristol. You've just been asked by the media about your second season. How have you? What have you made of second season? You seem to have really pushed on another level. You've developed your game more. You're getting more starts. You're playing more minutes. Yeah, no, it's, it's coming together nicely. Um, obviously, with Stuart Hogg going away for the for the Six Nations and the Autumns, it's given me the opportunity to to slot into that 15 role. I've had a few slots on the wing as well, which is good to build around my old game. But you know, it's been really good. I've taken a lot of a lot of opportunity, and um, I've learned a lot of hockey while he's been here as well. So it's win-win, really. How tough will it be for the boys if they just miss out on this the, these playoffs? Because you've been there or thereabouts. But yeah. The, the, some of the results, you you probably look back and go. We yeah, this. I think you know these these results now are going to define the season. But you know, it's hiccups earlier on in the season that we may have cost us this position that we've got now. Um, but you know we're looking to enjoy ourselves, we're looking to work hard, be the hardest working team, and you know put ourselves on the line and give our best. And if we do that, then hopefully we'll come away with the win. As a northern boy, can you get excited about a southern derby? I mean, I get excited <laughs> about every game. To be honest, every minute, every minute on the pitch for me is vital. Obviously, with Stuart at this club, so you've just got to take every opportunity and give it your best. What are you expecting from Bristol? Uh, a lot of joué rugby, a lot of play, throw it around. Probably have quite a few kicks in play that are just off the cuff, and you know we've just got to react to that. We've just got to be on our button, you know, mentally and physically. We've just got to react and play what's in front of us. And what can we expect from the Chiefs? Without giving away too much in the game plan. A, a good game of rugby. <laughs> Brilliant. Okay, perfect.